How's it going guys? Today I've got something crazy. I've got a bunch of Chrome extensions that will change your entire life. It's going to skyrocket your design career. It's going to make you a better person. Not really. Uh, these are ju just some Chrome extensions that I find super useful that I think you guys may find interesting and useful. So let's jump right into it. Hey guys, I'm Izzy with Flux, and today I wanna show you guys that I have way too much time on my hands and way too many Chrome extensions. I mean, look at this. Uh, my search bar is like two and a half inches in width just from how many Chrome extensions I have. So today it's gonna be super rapid fire. I'm just gonna share a bunch of really uh, useful extensions that I use daily and that you guys might enjoy. So let's jump right into it. Okay, first one is color picker. You know, a lot of you probably, to figure out the hex hexadecimal code for something, you may just take a screenshot, maybe drag it into uh, Figma and then get the color that way. But so this kind of bypasses that process. All you do is click on the extension, hover over whatever, you know, color, and you get the, you get the hexadecimal right away, right? Click to copy, bam, done. That's color picker, super useful. Many of you may have already known about it, but there it is. Next on the list is what font. And this is, this one's super simple, but very nifty and useful. It's easy, it lets you, it basically allows you to identify any font on the screen. Uh, so you click on the, the what font extension, hover over any piece of text, and you can even click and you know, not only do you get the typeface, but you get the style, the weight, the, the font size, line height, color. I know that a lot of people uh, take screenshots and then they drag it into Font Squirrel, I think, the font identifier that they have, uh, which is pretty pretty cool. I used to do that back in the day, but um, it's not as accurate, I find. So this is great. You could also just inspect um, and look at the code and get the font that way. But this just by this is just so much faster, right? Next up we have show me the styles, a personal favorite of mine. Um, I use this one all the time for the website redesign stories that we do on Instagram. And, and here's why. So it basically allows you to grab, it basically provides you with everything on a web page, the styles, the assets, everything. So you click on the uh, show me the styles extension. And so not only do you get, you know, the typefaces, all the colors on the web page, but you also get all the images, the icons, everything, and you can export them right then and there, um, which is super useful if you ever have to, if you ever need to do that. Okay, next on the list is built with. And so we do a lot of, um, whenever we do the top five websites of the month videos, we get a lot of comments like, were these websites built in Webflow? Can I build this in Webflow? Well, this basically answers that. This allows you to identify if a website, where, how a website was built. Was it used, um, what, did they use WordPress, Webflow, Squarespace, whatever. So pretty simple. So here we're on the Flux website, which is obviously built in Webflow. Imagine if it was built in something else. Um, anyways, so you click on the built with extension. Make sure you're on the um, the tech tab, scroll all the way down. We're going to get there and you're looking for content management system. Yeah. So see content management system, Webflow. And, uh, but yeah, so this is super useful. This is for, you know, you people out there that always wonder whether you know, the websites that we're reviewing were built in Webflow or not. This is for you. So next one is um, it's called mobile browser emulator and a lot of you may want to, so you may want to see what a website looks like on mobile. And a lot of you may just inspect the page, right? Inspect the page, you know, click here, move the dock over to the, to the side and bam, there you go. But if you want a slightly faster way, then you have the mobile browser emulator extension. Bam, 
two clicks, you've got the mobile website. So yeah, I, ju I just like how this is just so much faster. Last one on the list, guys, is called uh, Ruler. And you know, you may be on a web page and you may be wondering how big you know, a certain element is, maybe a button. Um, so to quickly get the, the dimensions, you just click on the, the ruler extension. And let's say I wanna know how big this headline is. I don't know why I would, but there it is, bam, you get the width, height, you know, position, it's awesome. Um, so yeah, nifty little ruler tool there. Um, and yeah, that's that. Those are some of the uh, Chrome extensions that I use daily and that I just had to share with you guys. I'll have all the links for these uh, in the description, evidently, um, if you want to download them. And uh, but yeah, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Leave a comment. Um, let me know if we, if we should do more of these, you know, kind of tool compilations and uh, we'll do more. Um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Take it easy.